Hey guys, it's Madame Wario. Welcome back to uh, more Sims Bustin' Out. We need to tune up some stuff, but we kind of need to take care of ourselves first. Girl. So, what? Stop talking to me. I need to um, eat and get this taken care of. Um, or else my character's not going to be very happy. Um, it's like really super early in the morning, if you haven't checked already in the corner. Um, wow, that was awesome. Why is he spreading seed in his room? Ew, that sounded really gross. Don't say that. Let's pee. This is seriously like all you do in this game. You just like cheat off of Uncle Hayseed's house and living arrangements because yours suck. Um, Alright, we've got some tuning up to do. Also, in case you were wondering, um, in case you were wondering, wow, that's that does not sound good. Wondering, um, you cannot die in this game. Uh, this is not a Sims game where you can die or become ill or electrocute yourself. So, you know, the tune-up is not going to be an issue in that respect. Um, so that's something you don't have to worry about, which is really, really nice. Um, you know, I, I think it's really nice. Because then you're not constantly like, I'm going to die! Or, like, stupid things don't happen where you die. Um, Alright. Wow, this is a great noise to live with, by the way. Okay, so now we're going to repair this. And we'll have some lovely entertainment to watch in our house. Um, so, in a way, this game, because, I mean, they're both the same kind of game. This game is kind of like Animal Crossing, except without the cute animals and with more straight up goals, you know, instead of like, well, okay, just kidding, you can faint. Okay, dude, I disapprove. Fine, you suck. So, yeah, if this were real Sims, I would have died just now. Um, but anyway, what I was saying, this is kind of like Animal Crossing, where, you know, you make relationships with the animals. I mean, it's a little bit... Not the animals, the people. It's a little deeper, obviously, because you actually have relationship points and whatnot. Um, but, I mean, it's kind of the same thing, just because simulation games are, just, you know, pretty basic. Pretty standard. Okay, I'm tired of doing this a zillion times. Let's not do this. Um... Once we get past this section of, you know, this game, things will progress a lot better. And I'll probably be editing a lot of footage out, just like this kind of stuff, to quit beating around the bush. Um, I'll go ahead and show off everything for now, just because, you know, it's the beginning of the game, and, you know, our goals aren't so in-depth yet. Okay, dance if you're going to stand there. What is that? Awesome. She's so legit. Okay, yeah, you're done. Let's go, Coolio. Okay, stop waving to me. I need to fix this stupid refrigerator or you're gonna kill me. There we go. Now we're working it. Oh gosh. How's it 6.30 already in this game? I just woke up like two seconds ago. I guess all I've done is sleep though because I passed out. I'm glad that Uncle Hayseed was there to take care of me. He was really watching out for me. Alright, now we can talk to him. Because the next part is the super fun part. Oh, God. Everything is running smoothly now. Julio, you've been such a help. Would you mind... My lawnmower. Oh my god, yes. Sure, I can do that. Um, did I really just ask if I had to shower? Aw, bear hugs. Okay. Alright, so our new goal is the most complicated goal in the first state of the game. Mow the lawn and get a promotion. Um, Alright, so to mow the lawn, we have to go to the barnyard from 5 a.m. between 5 a.m. and 7 p.m. so we just missed what in the world was that overreaction what the f um cross <laughs> oh my god um, you know what? we're just gonna make our relationship awesome 
Oh, all the background changes smiley faces. Oh, oops. Country bumpkin. Okay, smiley faces again. Just like in real Sims, if you reach 50 points on your relationship scale, you'll become friend status. Um. <laughs> true, the one about three legged horse. Our old farms is dirty. Now I know why Aunt Hazy left. I love how there's like weird adult humor in here. Just in little bits sure, sure. and pieces. I had nothing good to say to him just now. Um, okay. So, let's go in here. Wow, the chickens have stopped crowing. Ew, I'm not gonna sit on that. Let's sleep. Alright. We'll try to get to 5 a.m. as soon as we can. I do want to go over the option screen, though. Um just because there's some stuff I haven't covered in it, which we it's not really important yet, but I do want to talk about it um, just a little bit to get you guys on track. Alright, so Uncle Hasey doesn't sleep. Let's play Lawn Mower. And you guys are going to love the music from this game if you're a Sims fan. Mow the weeds! Press the A button to accelerate um, the mower and left and right to control on the control pad to steer it. Avoid the rocks and your uncle's precious flowers. <laughs> oh my gosh. So, this is not as easy as it looks, okay? Like that. I just did a fantabulous job. So, okay, I need to share a really funny story right now. My best friend, who equips me with the most awesome, or did equip me with the most awesome Game Boy Advance games ever, in my childhood. Um, see? I love this song. Uh, she was like, you won't believe this game I got for Christmas, which is why I played this on New Year's Day and why I got this on New Year's Day. Um, she was like, my mom knew I loved Sims, so she bought... Gosh dang it, you suck! She got me Sims busting out, and I had to mow the grass and ran over too many flowers, and so my life went down the drain. She's like, I can't do this. Oh my gosh, it was so funny. Um, and so we we spent like an hour and a half trying to mow the grass on this stupid game. We were like, wait, let me try it. Just because the controls are so funky in this grass, it's like a I've ever seen. Um, okay, seriously, we're not doing too bad, but we're not doing too good either. Okay, there's a rock there. Um, I love the remix version of this shopping song going on right now, though. Um, you get to be, like, awesome at this, though. Seriously, after you do it every once in a while. Crap. You're, like, amazing at it. I didn't mean to. Okay, seriously. I don't think we're gonna get a promotion this time, because we've, like, seriously run over all the flowers. By the way, a minute in Sims time is actually one second in our time. Well, sweet! Okay, we didn't do that badly. Alright, mission complete. I cut the grass. Holy sheep fleece, my lawn looks like a golf course. Unfortunately, I don't have time to admire it. Someone has let all my chickens loose. This is the sixth time in a month. No, not the chickens! Okay. Sure, I'll help. Um... Now we have to wait. Yes. So now we have to go and work the chickens. No, I'm not going to talk to you. Um, okay. And this is the start of a brand new goal. So bring eight chickens to Uncle. Find Detective Dan. Uh, before I do that, I want to show off um, several other features in the... Um, the menu screen, just because I think it's important. Um, okay, so first of all, well, once we get out of the shower, I'll show this off. For God's sake, quit showering. Okay, thank you. 
Okay, so aside from your goal screen, as you can see right here, um, you can also see your money on this screen, which is very important later on. Um, also, um, here you can check all your relationships and your popularity number. This will matter later as you get hired for more jobs. Um, and then you see your skill points down on the left bottom corner. Um, those will also mat matter later on um, as you get more jobs. Um, and then those weird little things that say pockets and, well, under pockets that have like a zero next to them, you can collect those and sell them um, to different places in um, Sim Valley to earn money. So all this stuff will become important later, but I want to go ahead and explain it now just because um, that way we get it out of the way. Um, okay, so next time I'm going to start with goal list number two on Uncle Hayseed's farm. Um, there are actually five goal lists on each location that you live in because you do move around on this game. Um, I'm going to try to cover as much as I can in each episode. I want to keep the video length between 15 and 20 minutes, so that's why um, I'm going to wait till next time to start this. But, uh, yeah, that is it for now. Um, again, this has been Madame Wario. Um, we're going to make a call, even though we don't know anybody to call. Oh, there we go. Hey, I'm be hanging around the clock tower. Okay, anyway, I don't know why we just did that. Um, all right, so this is Madame Wario. Thank you guys so much for joining me once again on The Sims Bustin' Out. It's raining. Um, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out.